हेलो गाइस वेलकम एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल जेबीआर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल सो हेलो एवरीवन वंस अगेन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल जेबीआर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज 21.3 फ्रॉम द बुक ऑफ एम एल अगरवाल ओके सो हियर द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम सम नंबर वन Find the mode of the following sets of number. Okay, so here the first one seven five seven six eight. Okay, five seven six eight nine zero six eight one eight. Okay, these are the numbers. You have to find out the mode of these numbers. So how to find out the mode of these numbers? Here you have to find out. the number which occur maximum times i repeat the number which occur maximum times so here you find easily that 8 occur 3 times okay okay so here 8 occur 3 times that means the mode of this number mode of this numbers are 8 okay it's very easy to find out the mode you have to just find out the number which occurs maximum times now next one number 2 so here 5 1 time 2 time 3 time okay so here number 5 occur maximum times so your mode equal to here 5 now next one number 2 Question number two, number one, find. Oh, sorry, only one sums are there. Okay. Question number two, find the mean, median, and mode of the following distribution. Okay, mean, median, and mode of the following distribution. So first, write down the distribution here: eight, ten, seven, six, ten, twelve, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, thirteen, ten. Okay. So to find out the mean it's very easy to find out the mean first you have to add all the numbers just add it that means 8 plus 10 plus 7 plus 6 plus 10 plus 11 plus 6 plus 13 and plus 10 so your addition will be 81 and how many numbers are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so you have to divide 8 by 9 so your our first answer mean equal to Nine. Okay, mean equal to nine. Now for the next one, first here you have to write down this number in ascending order. So here six, six, seven, eight, ten, 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 eleven, thirteen. Okay, write down in ascending order. Now here for the median. So for the median, how many numbers are there? Total nine numbers. So that means here in Equal to an odd number. So if n equal to an odd number, then for the median, the formula is n by one th term. That means here nine plus one by two th term. So that means here fifth term. Now which one is the fifth term? First, second, third, fourth, fifth. So that means ten here the fifth term. Okay. So your answer is ten. That means median equal to ten. Now the last one, mode. Mode means Which number occurs maximum times? So here ten occur one, two, three times. So your mode equal to ten. So these are your three answers. Now next one number three. In number three, calculate the mean, median, and mode of the following numbers. Again, similar type of problem. So I hope you can solve this one. So move on to number four. In number four. the marks of 10 students okay the marks of 10 student of a class in an examination arranged in ascending order are as follows first one 13 35 43 46 x x plus 4 55 61 71 72 73 okay so these are the numbers If the median marks is forty-five, so median equal to forty, sorry, forty-eight. It's given. Find the value of x. So you know for the how to find out the median. 
So how many numbers are there? Here total 10 numbers are there. That means here n is an even number. So for the even number, the formula for the median that equal to n by 12th observation, that means 5th observation plus 6th observation, then divided by 2. So here the 5th observation is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It's x, 6 observation, x plus 4, then divided by 2. So that means 2x plus 4 by 2. So it will be here x plus 2 by 1. Okay, if you come on 2 from the numerator, then 2 will be cancelled out. So your that one equal to x plus 2. So if x plus 2 is the median, so x plus 2 equal to 48 according to your problem. So x equal to here 46. Okay, so that means x equal to 46. Now you have to also find out the mode. So again write down the numbers 13, 35, 43, 46. In the place of x, write down 46 again. Second one, x plus 4, that means 46 plus 4, 50, 55, 61, 71, 80. Now to find out the mode here, 46, okay, 46 occur maximum times. So your mode equal to, mode equal to also 46. Now next one, sub number 5. Okay, so guys, if you like my video, please, please share this video and please subscribe my channel. Okay, for the others chapter, you can also visit our website. The link of the website is in your description box. So here, sum number 5. In sum number 5, find the mode and median of the following frequency distribution. So here, first write down the, for x and f means frequency. So here, 10, frequency 1. 11 frequency 4, 12 frequency 7, 13 frequency 5, 14 frequency 9 and 15 frequency 3. Okay, you have to find out the mode and median. So next find out cumulative frequency. I hope you know how to find out. So frequency and cumulative frequency. The first one will be equal. So 1 here also 1. Now 1 plus 4 it will be here 5. 5 plus 7 is 12, 12 plus 5 17, 17 plus 9 26, 26 plus 3 it's 29. That means here n is 29. So it's a odd number and for the odd number then median equal to n plus 1. So 29 plus 1 that means 30 by 2. So 15th term okay that means 15th observation. So here for the 15th observation as here you know from 12 to 17 okay from 12 to 17 the value for the observation is 13. So it means here for 15th observation your answer is here 13 okay. So here median equal to 13. Now next one you have to find out the mode. So here the mode here first find out the highest frequency. So as here the highest frequency is 9 that means here 14 is your mode okay because the frequency corresponding to 14 is maximum. I repeat the frequency corresponding to 14 is maximum so 14 is your mode okay now next one. Number 6 the marks of 40 students. Okay, the marks of 40 students are obtained by the student in a class. Test out of 10 are given below. Okay, so first write down the marks. Here are 1, 2, 3 in this way. You have to write down the marks here. So here mark, sorry. The first one will be here marks and second one here number of students or you can write down also frequency. So 1. It's also 1, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, also 3, 5, 6, 6, 10, next one, 7, 5, 8, 4, 9, 3, 10, 3. Now next one, cumulative frequency. So 1, it's 3. 
3 plus 3 6, 6 plus 3 9, 9 plus 6 15, 25, 30, 34, 37, 40. That means here n equal to even number. So median equal to here n plus by 2 that means your 20th term plus 21th term divided by 2. So for 20th term and 21th term that means 15 to 25 and that for the value is equal to here 6. So 6 plus 6 by 2 that means 6. So here median equal to 6 and mode equal to highest frequency here 10. So here mode equal to also 6. Now next one sum number 7. In sum number 7, here the marks obtained by 30 students in a class assessment of 5 marks is given below. So first one here marks, second one here frequency, third one cumulative frequency. So for 0 it's 1, for 1 it's 3, for 2 it's 6, for 3 it's uh, 10, for 4 it's 5 and for 5 again 5. So 1, 4, 10, 20, 25 and then 30. That means here n equal to also even number. So median equal to, I hope you know the formula, n by 2th term that means 15th term plus 16th term divided by 2. So for 15 and 16 that means here 10 to 20. Okay. So here your frequency is here. What is the mark? Here mark is your 10. Okay. That means here 3. So here mark is equal to here 3 not 10. 10 is the frequency. So 3. That means your answer 3 plus 3 by 2 that means it's 3 and now next one find out the mode. So for the mode here the highest frequency is 10. So again 3. So mode equal to also 3. So median equal to 3 mode equal to 3. Now next one you have to also find out the mean. So I hope you find out the mean very easily. Just uh, add this number that means summation fx then divided by summation f. Okay, I repeat summation fx then divided by summation f. So for summation f 0 into 1 then 1 into 3 then 2 into 6 in this way. Okay, then 3 into 10, 4 into 5 and 5 into 5. Just add all the numbers. So it will be here 90 and then divided by summation f that means summation of the frequency and that one equal to here 30. So 90 by 30 that one equal to also 3. Very easy. Okay, now move on to next one, sum number 8. The distribution given below shows the marks obtained by 25 students in an aptitude test. Find the mean, median, mode and distribution. Okay, again similar kind of problem. So I hope you can solve this one. So now move on to the last problem, sum number 9. Okay, so guys, if you like my video, please, please share this video and please subscribe my channel. So here the last one, the following table gives weekly wages in rupees of in rupees of workers in a factory. Okay, so here first one the wages, so write it down 50 to 55 and here the number of workers or frequency that one equal to 5. Next one 55 to 60, number of frequency 20, 60 to 65, frequency 10. 65 to 70, frequency 10, 70 to here 75, frequency 9, 75 to 80, frequency 6, 80 to 85, frequency 12 and the last one 85 to 90, here the frequency is 8, okay. So now next one, find out the class mark and the last one here. Cumulative frequency or also you have to find out the apex because you have to also find out the mean. Okay, so what is the class mark? Class mark is the middle number, okay, or at the midpoint of this here, the this uh, 50 to 50, this class interval. Okay, you have to find out the middle of this class interval that is the class mark. To find out the class mark, here the formula is upper limit plus lower limit divided by 2, that means 55 plus 50 by 2 that one equal to here 25.5 
sorry 52.5 not 25 52.5 okay i repeat the formula for the class mark is upper limit plus lower limit divided by 2 now here the class interval the uh, height of the class that is uh, 5 because 50 to 55 the gap is 5 55 to 60 again gap is 5 so just add 5 with this one the upper one then you will get the another class mark so it will be 62.5 again at 5 67.5 again at 5 72.5 is a shortcut method 77.5 82.5 last one 87.5 okay so for the first one for the first one you have to apply the formula that is upper limit plus lower limit by 2 for the next one just add the class height with the previous class mark okay now cumulative frequency first one will be 5 5 plus 20 25 then 35 45 then 54 60 72 80 okay now find out the fx that means f into class mark so 5 into 52.5 262.5 20 into 57.5 it's 1150.0 then 625.0 and 700.0 you have to add this one so summation of fx 5520.0 or just write down 5520 and summation f equal to 80 so now first find out the mean so mean the formula is summation fx by summation f so 5520 by 80 0, 0 cancel out and your answer is here 69 okay now next one here modal class so for the modal class the frequency of 55 to 60 the frequency of 55 to 60 that is maximum that means 20 okay so here 55 to 60 is your is the modal class okay now the next question number of workers getting weekly wages below 80 okay so below 80 means so you have to find out here 5 20 10 10 9 and 6 okay so below 80 these are the number so here the cumulative frequency is 60 so that means for the second one here sorry the third one the third one your answer is 60 now next one the number of workers getting 65 or more but less than 85 so 65 or more but less than 85 so here up to 85 the number of workers is 72 and below 65 here the number of workers is 35 okay so that means you have to subtract 35 from 72 and that one equal to here 37 that is your answer 